if you're new to this channel, my name is Tears of Sephora, and today I'm going to be unboxing my first ever Jeffree Star mystery box, or as my favorite YouTuber Gloria likes to say it, Jeffrey Estrella. Anyways, I also kind of regret buying this box because I'm not supposed to be spending money, and my boyfriend was also a little upset on me spending money because I'm supposed to be saving for like other priorities, so this will probably be my... I guess last Jeffree Star products I'm ever gonna buy. So without further ado, let's just get on to the video. Okay, so this is how the box looks like and I'm super duper excited. I'm like really hyped for it because again, it's my first box and I got the deluxe box and I was lucky enough because he ran out of stock. Okay, that took a while to open the box but this is how it looks like. It's wrapped. So yes this is how it looks like i'm super excited to open it up i can't wait to see it i'm just like yeah because like he has like a mystery like i don't know lipstick oh my gosh guys uh okay i'm super excited really really excited so this is how it looks like there we go hopefully y'all can see that i don't want to spill it though look at this it's a lot of stuff it's amazing here is the straw this is how the star i mean this is how the star oh my gosh this is how the um straw looks like scratch that i was gonna say star to be honest i actually like this straw i was gonna give it to my friend but i don't know i might keep it so yeah i actually love the straw i told her that i was gonna give her the straw because like i didn't really need it but i don't know i kind of like it so i might keep it because obviously it's my favorite color and it's just like super duper like beautiful. I don't know. I think I'm going to keep the straw. So I apologize to my friend. I might not give it to you because I just fell in love with it. It's my favorite color. So I'm really sorry. Moving on. This one is a lip scrub. Oh, I love lip scrubs. This one is called Rainbow Sherbet. Here's how it looks like up close the little box is super cute and it just says you know what i also love about jeffree star's cosmetics though i know this is super random but i just love the fact that like most everything that he has is like pink and obviously pink is like my favorite color it's like my first favorite color actually because my second favorite is blue okay so this is how the Baylor lip scrub looks like and the, again this one's called rainbow sherbet and here it is. It is super duper cute. I absolutely love it. And I can't wait to smell this one. This one is green. Oh my gosh. Okay, that one smells really good. I actually have a Baylor lip scrub. And the first one that I have is, um, I think it was like watermelon. This one is absolutely gorgeous. I love it. It's green. It smells really good. Oh my gosh. Makes me want to eat it. You know what's really amazing though about his Bather lip scrubs? You can actually eat it and I didn't even know that. So I found that out like till later and I was like surprised. Anyways, the next thing here we have a pop socket. Here it is. I think I might give this one to my friend. I don't really need the pop socket. The pop socket. If it was pink or like blue, I would have absolutely loved it. Orange isn't my color, so I'm going to give this one to my friend. And I apologize again to my friend. I was going to give you the straw, but I'm sorry. I think I'm going to keep it, but I'm definitely going to give her the pop socket. So, moving on. I'm um, also really excited for this one because this is a Supreme Frost Highlighter Powder. And you could also use it like as an eyeshadow. I'm really excited about this one because I do not own any highlighters, Supreme Frost or anything by Jeffree Star. And I always wanted one. So I finally got one and I'm like super excited. So yes, um, I'm going to see what this one is. Let's see. Oh, I like what it says in the back. It's like sparkle to the max, bling bling bitch, shine bright like a lighthouse, extreme payoff, vegan and cruelty free. Cruelty free. Oh my gosh. I love how like he is so creative with his makeup products honestly okay so this one is called money honey and here's how it looks like it is super duper cute I apologize for like the reflection again on the ring light and oh my gosh look how cute this is and again favorite color it's pink super beautiful I absolutely love it like look how shiny this highlighter is like oh my gosh I cannot wait to use this on my face. I'm actually going to swatch it on my finger. Oh my gosh, look at this. Look at this. It's like a gold color. I don't know if you can see that on my finger. 
but there it is it's super beautiful oh my gosh look how gorgeous that is damn super duper pretty okay the next one here this one is a lip liner if i'm not mistaken this one's called doll parts super cool again let's see how this one looks like if i can open the box that would be really great <laughs> i'm struggling oh my gosh look how cute it is i'm really excited ah okay ah can't open it damn it come out oh wait i think it has this thing stuck there you go look how cute this is oh my gosh look at it i am just like super in love with this and it has like the whole jeffree star name on it Hopefully you all could see this. I'm sorry if like the reflection, but oh my gosh, it's gorgeous. I love it. This one was called, wait, what was it called again? Oh, this one was called Doll Parts. Super beautiful. Look at this. Look at this gorgeous color. I'm going to swatch it on my arm right now. Don't know if you all could see this on my arm, but it's over here on the first one. Moving on, this one is called, this one's a Baylor liquid lipstick. This one is called Diva, and the box is super cute. So I'm definitely gonna try these on. I'm really scared because I'm not like, I'm really scared actually, I was actually scared to buy this box because I don't like dark colors. Dark shades don't suit me or sit, uh, or like basically, Basically, dark colors do not suit my skin tone. My brother has, ar has already told me that. I don't know why I'm getting tongue-tied. My brother has told me that I do not look good in dark shades. It makes me look really weird. <laughs> and so I'm going to take a guy's advice because, you know, guys know more or less what looks good on a girl. So, yeah, definitely, like, dark lip shades don't look good on me. So that's what I was afraid of. So anyways, moving on. I know I'm getting off topic. So this is how the Jeffree Star Baylor Liquid Lip Shade looks like. It is super beautiful. I'm living for this color. I've always wanted a pink um, lipstick or like a Baylor lip. So I am super excited. I do not own any like Baylor lipsticks from Jeffree Star. So this is my first. Next one here is called Ponceria or I don't know how to pronounce that. Um, but here you go. I'm really excited. This one looks like a red, so I'm really hyped for this. You all know, well, most of you all know, I love red shades. So, ooh, wait, this one is gorgeous. Oh my gosh, I'm loving this. Look at it. It's super pretty. It's a red color, and it has, like, glitter little shimmers kind of thing inside. I am super hyped for this. Oh my gosh. Look at this look at this oh my gosh i'm just super excited the little brush is really cute super duper cute you know what let me swatch these colors on my arm first and then i'll try them on on my lips so again this one was called diva let's just swatch on diva on my arm super gorgeous oh my gosh i'm living for this okay so this was the Diva one. Hopefully y'all could see this on my arm. The next one that I'm going to swatch on my arm, which was the Ponceta or Pon... I don't know what it's called. I cannot pronounce the name. But um, anyways, I'm going to swatch this one on my arm. Oh my gosh. This one is super gorgeous. I'm in love. I'm in love with this shade. The red one is absolutely my favorite. Hopefully y'all can see this one as well. Okay, this one's called Celebrity Skin. Of, of course, the box is really cute. I'm going to swatch this one too on my arm. Super hyped for it. I can't wait to see this one. I'm actually scared because it's like a darker color. Oh, okay. So this one's like a nude color. Let's see how this one looks. Ooh, this one is pretty. It's very similar to another one that I have. It's actually kind of like a brownish nude color, and I love it. I actually love this one as well. I'm kind of scared to try it out on my skin because, on my lips, I mean. My skin, what am I talking about? Like, girl, what? Um, but I'm scared to, like, try it on on my lips because I don't know how it's going to come out. So, the final lipstick shade that I have, it's another Baylor Liquid Lipstick. This one is a mystery one that he was talking about, so let's see how this one is. I'm really scared. I'm just hoping it's not like a dark shade because again, I don't look good in dark shades. So please, no dark shades. Please, please, please. 
Oh, okay. Oh my gosh. What is this? This one is a mystery color. I go. This is how this one looks like. Super duper beautiful. It's like another kind of like a lighter shade of pink. I don't know. Oh, I'm living for it too. Oh my gosh. It's gorgeous. Okay, so I don't know if you all could see this, but it's like the last one somewhere on the side. I can't really see. I don't have my glasses. Uh, okay, I'm super excited. Next one that I'm going to try on is this shirt, and this is how it looks like. Obviously, I like I like having black shirts. Also, black is another one of my favorite colors. I know they don't consider it a color, but it is. So, I saw a lot of people open their boxes, and they have a shirt as well. This one is a size small because, you know, I'm teeny tiny, but I don't know how it's going to fit me because I'm, like, super petite. So, I'm pretty sure it's going to fit me big but this is how it looks like yeah it's really big so in the back it says hi how are ya here we go it's super beautiful though i love it oh my gosh and it has like the little star i'm actually gonna put it on right now so let me do that it's gonna it's most likely gonna fit me like really big oh my gosh okay guys i absolutely love this shirt i was debating to give it to my friend as well because you know i'm like really petite and I just have like a hard time like finding shirts that fit me. I honestly wish she had like an extra small, but this is fine. I could just like tie it on the side and I think it's cute. I think I'm going to keep the shirt. I'm sorry again to my friend, but I absolutely love this product, like these products. If I had like a darker shade of like Baylor lipsticks, I would have definitely gave you one, but yeah, I just fell in love with it. Definitely going to give my friend the pop socket though. So I am really sorry. Please forgive me. I just fell in love with this and it's super gorgeous. Definitely going to keep it. What do you guys think? Does the shirt like look good on me? I absolutely love it. Here it is in the back. Don't know if you could see it. It says like, hi, how are you in the back? Super cool. I love it. Oh my gosh really living for it okay everybody so now i'm gonna start swatching these lipstick shades on my lips let's see how they look like really excited okay so the first one that i'm gonna try on is the one that's called diva let's see how this one like um fits me so i'm a little nervous because sometimes colors don't look very well on me let's see how this goes Okay, everybody, so this one is a Diva Veiler lipstick shade, and I absolutely love it. It's super beautiful. What do you all think? Do I look good in pink or no? I mean, feel free to let me know down in the comments about, like, what shades look good. So, yeah, this one is on me. I absolutely love the color. I think it's really beautiful. Super duper stunning. Absolutely. I feel like I messed up right here on the corner. Anyways, don't judge me for that, but what do you all think of this color? It's really gorgeous. Anyways, moving on, let's just get on to the next Baylor Liquid Lipstick shade. Okay, so the next Baylor Liquid Lipstick shade I'm going to try out is this one that I cannot pronounce, which is the Poinsinera one. I don't know how to say it, but I'm going to try out this one. Okay, 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 okay. This one is definitely my first top favorite one that I have so far of his Veiler Liquid Lipstick Shades. Oh my gosh, it's super beautiful. I know my lips look like I have a rash right now because I tried removing the pink one, the Diva, Lix the Diva Liquid Lipstick Shade, and it didn't come off. Anyways, this is how it looks like. It's super gorgeous. I love how it has like a little shimmer on the Liquid Lipstick Shade. It's super gorgeous. I absolutely love this one on me. What do you all think? Do you guys love this one on me? Because I absolutely do. So the next lipstick that I'm going to try on is called the Celebrity Skin. And this is how it looks like. I wonder why he calls it the Celebrity Skin. But um, let's, how, let's see how this one looks like on my lips. I'm absolutely afraid of this one because some of these colors do not look good. But we'll see. too sure about the celebrity skin one i think it looks kind of weird on me i don't know i mean i kind of like it for like a natural look but i just don't feel it like i just don't think it looks very good on me i don't know i guess because it's like my skin tone i don't know i don't know i know i keep saying that a lot but 
eh. Actually, as it's drying, I think I could see it. It looks good as a natural color. I'll probably add in like maybe a lip gloss shade on top, like a shimmery lip gloss. Because I know I have a shimmery brown lip gloss and I think it would look really gorgeous over this color. So, I don't know. What do you all think? I think it'll look really good with like if it's topped on with like a lip gloss, like a shimmering one. So, this is how it looks like. I keep turning my face around, but here we go. Yeah, this one smells really good. It actually smells like root beer. It smells super good. The last lipstick shade that I'm using is the mystery one. I don't know what this one is called, so it has no name. So anyways, I'm gonna try out this one. Let's see how it goes. I really do not like this mystery shade color on me. It just doesn't suit me very well I don't really like it it just looks I don't know it looks really weird very very weird what do you all think I think it really does look weird it doesn't really suit me so I don't know I just don't really like the mystery color on my skin personally I think it will look very well on another person probably not me it just doesn't suit me okay everybody so that is it for today i absolutely enjoyed this mystery box and i honestly expected to have like maybe an eyeshadow palette because i thought he was basically what i thought was i thought he was gonna put in like the small jawbreaker palette and i was hoping that he did because I really wanted to get that one, but he didn't. So I was a little disappointed on that, but that's okay. I'm really glad that I got this box because I really can't afford, like, buying single Jeffree Star products, like, by itself. Because it, it is very expensive. So I was, like, extremely happy that I was able to get this deluxe box that has, like, a lot of products. So now I'm able to have, like, a lot of Jeffree Star products into, like, my collection. So... I'm really excited for that and again I do kind of regret spending a lot of money on this deluxe box because again I have other priorities but um yeah it was really fun also you all let me know down in the comments um, which lipstick shade was your favorite and were you able to purchase a, a mystery box or whatever and which color was your favorite if you did purchase a box so just let me know which lipstick shade was your favorite in this box. I mean, which one that you liked on me. Like I said, the only ones that I didn't really like on me was the mystery color and also the celebrity skin one. I didn't really like this one or the mystery one. It just didn't suit me. But I think these two really suit me very well, which was the Diva and also the one that I couldn't pronounce, which is this red one. So... These two I absolutely loved so much on my lips. The other two, not so much. They don't really suit my skin, my skin tone, I guess. But I'm pretty sure it'll like suit other, other people. But it just didn't suit me very well, so I didn't really like them. So, anyways, again, let me all know. Let me know down in the comments which ones you did like on me, and if you did purchase a mystery box, what product was your favorite from them? Because I know some of the shades were different than other people. So yeah, anyways, that is it for today. If you all enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell notification so you all be notified for my next upcoming video. Anyways, bye everybody.